Marinesorb TV. I'm Michael Gavril from Marinesorb.com, and today we're at Executive Flightways at Washington Dulles International Airport. In previous Marinesorb videos, we've demonstrated how Marinesorb works on smaller quantity spills. Today, we're going to step it up a bit and show you how Marinesorb works in a typical aircraft hangar environment. We've pre-staged four different kinds of spills to demonstrate how Marinesorb can be used over and over again. Let's get started. I've staged four different spills that we commonly run into in the aviation business around the Hawker here. And uh, I'm gonna show you how Greensorb works on each one. And I'm not only gonna do that, I'm gonna use the same Greensorb on each spill as well. Now, everybody in aviation dreads the sky draw spill because it's extremely caustic and a pain to clean up. Greensorb loves it. Because Greensorb's reusable, our customers use possibly more than they need so that they can get more life out of the, out of the actual product. You can see Greensorb's fast at work here on the SkyDraw spill. Also, because Greensorb's an, an encapsulator, it makes it safe to handle. SkyDraw is extremely caustic and will burn your hands if not handled properly. You can see that I'm pretty much done here and I can pick up the green sorb and I get no SkyDraw on my hands. Pretty brave, huh? So I'm going to sweep this up and you can see there's no dangerous residue left on the floor so your safety issues are taken care of, you'll have fewer uh, slip and fall accidents, and you're ready to move on to your next spill. Back in the bucket. We're here at our second spill, which is Jet A. Every airplane leaks Jet A. So I'm going to take the same product that I use to clean up the sky draw, and I'm going to put it over the spill and let Greensorb go to work. Greensorb loves jet fuel. Once again, the product's working. It's right to work. It won't even notice the spill. Probably one of our biggest uh, product features that our customers really like is the fact that Greensorb's not flammable. So again, getting back to our employee safety elements, uh, you've, make, you've made the product, or you've taken the spill and made it safe to handle and removed all the chances of flammability, unlike our competitors, which that's certainly not the case. Turn the wings over to our working bucket. And that big, nasty jet fuel spill disappears. Again, no unsafe, slippery residue is left behind after we clean it up with Greensorb. Well, on to our next spill. For our third spill, we've, we've pre-staged some Mobile 254 engine oil. Now, if this were an actual spill, we'd have a bigger problem than just cleaning it up. But, apply some Greensorb to it, and we'll get it up in a flash. Now this stuff is particularly nasty because it will leave a stain on a beautiful floor like this. Given the chance to work, Greensorb will uh, take away all, any, any leftover residue or any uh, clue that there was even a spill here. Now, 
this is the third substance that we've cleaned up with the green sorb, with the same sample of green sorb. You can see how quickly it's still working, even on a thicker viscosity, thicker dense type of spill. No stain, no slippery residue left behind. On to our last spill. For our fourth and final spill, we've pre-staged some TKS fluid, or de-icing fluid, uh, near our hawker. Every hawker owner has had to do with TKS from time to time. So it's no problem for the green zorb. Pour a little bit on here. Out of our working bucket. So this is the spill I've cleaned up with the same green sort. And you can see how fast it's already starting to work. Again, this is a very caustic fluid. So because a green sort is an encapsulator, you're literally taking it out of the environment forever. is practically cleaned up right now. Get the green zorb back in the working bucket. Again, not a trace of the TKS fluid. It's perfectly dry, perfectly safe to walk on. And you have one less mess to clean up. So we've taken four common aviation spills around the aircraft in the hangar today. We cleaned up all four relatively quickly and easily with the same green zorb. I'm Michael Govro from greensorb.com and thank you for joining us today on Greensorb TV.